And what I want you to do is, is let's just talk about it a bit. When did you finish this, Alex? About a month and a half ago. Did you? And you worked on it for how long? Almost eight years. Tell me about it. Well, what can I say about it? I can explain what each uh, part let's, is. Yeah, let's go through each part. Okay. Section. Well, you obviously flag and the eagle speaks for itself. Sure. You got this is the uh, Alamo. This here, you see that there? It says uh, it's got a Marine Corps. Wow. This is Iwo Jima. I got the original. This, this, this is the flag and the group that originally flew, not the, the group that was famous for. Right. They were, and I couldn't, obviously, you can't identify them, so I put the goddess of Cena up in the clouds with the same, see what it says, uh, the uh, third platoon, and list, list their outfit, right? And this is the, this is civil rights, uh, uh, you know, it's the firemen holding down the demonstrators, the dog attacking the black man, and there's Martin Luther King being arrested, women's rights. Right below that is the uh, Battle of the, of, uh, the Maine in uh, Cuba. This is the, uh, the, the massacre of the American troops by the Germans at Malmody. And this here, obviously, oh, this is part of the Alamo. There's Santiana, there's the Molly Pitcher firing the cannon. These guys, these guys are the guys that uh, conquered the election bridge. And the British, these people are exactly where they fell. So the, the time, what took time was the research. Mm. Because I had to know where, the, where were the bodies, where they... You know, so I, I have to, I'm a stickler for authenticity. Here's, you see what it says, Enola Gay? Mm -hmm. This is the, uh, that's the, what the mushroom of the Hiroshima, not the Nagasaki bomb. I, I had to find a picture of the Hiroshima Why bomb. Why did you want the Hiroshima bomb over the Nagasaki? Because that was the first one okay. that uh, fell off. Then, this here is the uh, prisoner of war who speaks for itself. This is the Nurses Memorial. This is part of the Vietnam uh, Memorial here. There's notice there's the mother pointing to uh, apparently a dead father and a little boy crying. You know? And this here is the counteroffensive to uh, to the uh, Battle of the Bulge. Right? And over here we have a World War I cemetery here. You know, it's just, uh, the high detail, there's the American Eagle. Below it is the Constitution burning the Guerrier, and below that is the Battle of Midway. And below, next to that is the convoys in World War II. And there's the uh, Pearl Harbor. That's the Arizona going down. This here is the obvious, the towers. Uh, this is the first Homeland Security uh, insignia. And this is the statue of Saddam Hussein being knocked down in the, with the, the, the natives, with the American soldier watching, just throwing the shoes at the statue. And then uh, here, this is Afghanistan, and there's a the woman walking home with a child going back home under the protection of the American tank. And this is the Auschwitz. And these people are headed to the gas chambers. There's Heinrich Himmler. He, he was, I wanted to show the ultimate in cruelty where he casually used to like to light a cigar and smoke a cigar to hear the Jews screaming, you know, as they went to their death. So to me, then showed that they did go after the gays, too. They weren't just uh, Jewish people. And this this is the uh, gate that was stolen not too long ago. I understand it's not there anymore. These are the Marines that uh, uh, the frozen chosen. This is the 70th Tank Battalion attacking 
in North Korea. There's the uh, uh, Red Baron, and this is all speaks for itself. There's three people marching. You may recognize them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now, did I get everything? I think so, uh, yeah. I think that's it. Statue oh, of here they are, they're buried somewhere. This is the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier. I think you covered it all. Pretty amazing. Absolutely amazing. It was very, the difficult part of it was taking all these different units, small segments, right, and make it so it looks like one, one painting. Sure. Yeah. It's easy to write, you know, if there was no connection. But every time I put a color here, I had to see how it would, how, how would it affect you this side. Stand back and take a look, too. Yeah. So. Well, where do you want this to be someday? This is dedicated to, in fact, I'll give you a copy of the local newspaper four years ago when they were talking, when they put it up in the library, and I said it would be done by the end of the year. <laughs> well, it took me an extra four, four years to, to, to paint it. But this is dedicated to all free public libraries because the whole idea is that even if you have no money, you could really get a good education just by going to the public library. That's true. And this is a lesson in American history right here. And, and the, the, the libraries never get any credit for this. Yeah. So I thought it was about, I like to, to, to uh, correct injustices, if you want. Because they didn't get any credit. I'll, I'll do, I think, I believe this painting will be the painting that defines American freedom because it's got everything in there. As Bonnie Frank said when he saw it unfinished, Bonnie says it's the first time he's seen a painting, you know, with the civil battles as well as the regular, you know, military battles. Mm -hmm. So it's all combined. It's beautiful. So I don't know what else I can tell you about it. Where do you want it, where, where do you want it to end up? I'd like to see it in the Library of Congress. Bonnie was thinking in terms of, you know, uh, having it up in the nice capital, but I'd like to keep it away from politics. And put it Well, it is dedicated to free public libraries. And the yeah. number one library is the that, Library of Congress. That would make the most sense. Now, you know. Good. Well, congratulations on finishing it. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah, well, I guess I'll accept it. All I said when I put the last thank you, but thank God, no more. That's it. I'm not gonna. Well, I used to get a joke, get jokes from people that would see me working on it. You better hurry up before another war breaks out, and you got to put that war. Right. Is <laughs> so I was fighting against time. So and I, I don't know. Oh, that's great. That's absolutely fabulous, Alex. I'm proud to know you and to have seen oh. this. That, uh, that painting will. Yeah. If you figure, just figure where my paintings are now. Part of the Constitution.